Downtown Wheeling was filled with rainbows and smiles as the Ohio Valley Pride Festival took place all day at Heritage Port. 7 News reporter Ashley Kaiser joined in on the celebration. On the waterfront, the Ohio Valley is having their fourth annual Pride Festival here in Wheeling. Food vendors, music, performances, and more. This year's festival is especially extravagant since last year's festivities were canceled due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Ryan Stover, Pride Festival volunteer, says having this yearly event brings a sense of acceptance, comfort, and resources to many different people. Well, here in Wheeling, in West Virginia, we don't have a whole lot going on for like the LGBTQ community. So um, Jack Garbasho actually started this to kind of bring the community together. We have um, a lot of allies come out, um, supportive, um, whether they're you know gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender, straight. We're just a huge loving community, really. No matter who you are, it's for everyone. People of all ages gather downtown to march in support of the LGBTQ community. Stover says the purpose of the march is to stand together and show your true colors. The group waved flags and chanted love is love as they entered the festival. I've never had this experience before and it's so nice to have, like, to see all this. I feel that it is important to have something like this so we know that there are other people like us. Several booths at the event displayed resources and information, allowing those in attendance to have access to learn things such as self-defense. They also have live music and drag show performances. Everyone's out here celebrating and showing their support. Oh Reporting for 7 News, I'm Ashley Kaiser, oh. working for you. Ashley, thanks. And if you're just hearing about it, there's still some time. There's a drag show slated for 8, and the festival will continue until 10 p.m. tonight.